Hello and welcome to Firearm Freedom. This is going to be another first impressions video. In today's first impressions video, we are taking a look at this HRT shotgun placard. And before we get this video started, as always, there are links down in that description. The most important one right now is that first link. It brings you to the Firearm Freedom merchandise store. I see you guys buying my shirts. It's really getting me excited. I really, really appreciate it. I have some awesome shirt designs over there that I'm really proud of that I know you guys are going to love. So check out that first link, pick up a shirt, and rep the brand that is Firearm Freedom. If you want to make sure these videos are not being hidden from your subscription feed, comment down below. Like the video interact with the video. Hit the subscribe button. That stuff should let the algorithms know to keep these videos in your subscription feed. I am very excited about this HRT shotgun placard. First of all, full disclosure, what is my relationship with HRT Tactical? The, the folks over there are by far the coolest people that I have dealt with so far in this industry. They are incredible. A lot of them are actually subscribers to the channel, which I am honored to have. And they do send stuff like this out to me for free on the channel to check out and give my honest and unbiased opinion. And I, I seriously appreciate them supporting the channel and sending this stuff out. But aside from that, they always are interested in feedback. And that is why they're quickly becoming one of my favorite gear companies out there in the industry because they are constantly trying to improve. And I think they're a little bit confused when I asked for the shotgun placard because not, you know what? Not a lot of people run shotgun stuff and it makes me sad. I'm not, I'm not trying to say that the shotgun is the Even best defensive tool. Situation. All I'm saying is a lot of people should train with shotguns more. Nothing wakes you up like trying to do some drills and reloading a shotgun at the range. It'll definitely put some hair on your chest a little bit in trying to figure out how to run that gun properly. And one of the most difficult things that I have seen for shotguns is how to keep extra ammunition on your person. Now, there's a lot of different options out there. You have the S-Tac Velcro cards like this that can actually go into AR mag pouches. That's cool, but I have to repurpose my mag pouch. It doesn't work exactly like that. You have really kind of Bubba Goober style slings with shotgun shells all over it, and then you have belts with shotgun shells all over it. Those options work okay, but ultimately what everyone goes to, including myself, is just mounting via a side saddle option, a shot shell carrier on the shotgun itself. Now that's cool when you're looking at something like this shotgun. Yes, this side saddle style option over here on the side by Mesa Tactical, it works great. I have no complaints about that, but this is going to give me six rounds and including what's in the gun, right? And you hear everybody say, hey, you're gonna fight with, quote unquote, what's on your shotgun. Well, that's great, but I only might have around 12 rounds on my person. How do I keep more? There's not really a great option. Then I found the HRT shotgun placard. I saw this on their website, and I believe they were even considering, don't hold me to this, I could be totally wrong, but I believe they were considering kind of like repurposing it or phasing it out entirely, because not a lot of people buy this stuff, and, and I get it. But I had ideas for this. This is not supposed to be used as a standalone chest rig, but I saw these loops on the side here, and this is supposed to be mounted like on a plate carrier or on another chest rig or something like that to give you shotgun options on the front of you. But I saw these loops, I'm like, dude, I'm gonna use that as a chest rig. And I know it's not designed for that, but I'm gonna use it as a chest rig. And it was killing it at the range as a chest rig today. Guys, there is, first of all, there's no weight to this. So it's, you don't even feel this on your chest. What I really love about this is you have 21 rounds of total capacity here, including the six rounds that are on the shotgun and the ammunition that's inside of the shotgun. So I don't have to worry about a million shotgun shells banging around in my dump pouch that I'm constantly pulling out. I have almost an entire box of 25 shot shells here on the front of me. 
and that is huge. I can reload actually quickly from this setup because the, the rounds are right where I need them to be. They're right on my chest, I just pull them right out. I don't have to worry about ripping out an extra card and ripping off Velcro and putting a new one on. It's just right here. I'm just reloading right from here to the shotgun. I mean, I was reloading single rounds and it was working incredibly well. But HRT, if you guys are listening to this right now, if you've made it through this video, hear me out. I think this would work. I think this would make you a lot of money. All I ask for is a little bit of a, a name partnership here. Let me get let me get a little bit of that name, like the, the, the Freedom Rig or something, or the Firearm Freedom Rig, something cool like that. It would make my world. But hear me out. This is what I'm thinking. So keep this up here in the front, beef out the back, and make this either capable like your modulus rig to insert in rifle mag pouches or pistol mag pouches, or just keep it a zipper for admin stuff, keeping in extra things, map, whatever, and then have it capable of accepting the danglers on the side, Man, run it as a nice chest rig. I, I guarantee you that some of my shotgun folks out there would absolutely love it. And I myself would really love it. And I think it would be a hell of a setup because it allows you a practical way to have a lot of shotgun ammunition on your person. This has been an issue in the shotgun world of defensive shotgun shooting for years and years and years and years. And there's just not a lot of practical solutions that aren't just three gun related. But this is probably one of my favorites. You get their standard airflow backer and they were kind of letting me know, hey, you know, it's not exactly set up to run as a chest rig. So, you know, you're going to have a lot of this Velcro out on the side, which you do. But I got news for you guys. I did not feel this at any point during the range day. So not really the end of the world there. This was very, very comfortable. And you do have, of course, Velcro capable all on the back side. And this has been great for me. I, I don't even think this is on there in the proper position. So I just slapped it on there and called it a day and it was working just fine. These are elastic. The retention was perfect. No issues at all there. I tried it with some three inch Magnum slugs. Same deal, no issues. Getting those rounds to fit properly. And you are typically going to work from the left to right if you are a right-handed shooter, just because trying to actually get this out of that position, you guys are gonna notice that it's, it's gonna hit that shotgun shell. So you're gonna kind of work this row, then this row, then this row, and it gets easier and easier. I was angling the brass towards the left side of me, so that way I could just pop it out, put it into the shotgun, call it a day. And I am running uh, the HRT H harness on here in the back. No issues with that. It held it tight against my person. And you got a lot of real bad day up here in the front of you with 21 rounds going downrange to whatever unlucky object is down there. Even if they don't make this into anything else or they phase it out entirely, I would buy this while you can. Again, they're not they're not paying me to say this. They, they aren't telling me to tell you guys to buy it. I just, those of you guys out there that watch the channel that are into shotguns, I think you would really like this. And I, I think it's a, a kind of a knockout of the park in just a really good shotgun rig that is simple. There's nothing going on with it. There's not a lot of three gun locking things that are gonna fall all over the place. It's a simple way to carry more shotgun ammunition and have it very low profile on your body. I mean, you could easily conceal this under a freaking t-shirt if you had to, let alone a flannel or a hoodie or a jacket or whatever else. It is gone and it gives you more ammunition. On top of that, if you needed to carry it in a backpack, even if they added on their little back section here, you could very easily slip this into a freaking laptop pouch if you needed to and you could have it completely discreetly concealed with 21 extra rounds of ammunition to go along with your shotgun. I know this is a little bit of a short video, but it just, it, there's not much to say about it. It's a great placard. You guys will be seeing the B-roll. We were running it like crazy at the range and I'm pretty much in love with this thing, especially with the fact that it's super cheap on their website. Of course, you would have to buy the straps extra, but you could just run it on a plate carrier and call it a day. So if you guys have any other questions about this placard from HRT Tactical, let me know down in the comment section. I'll get back to every single one of you while you're down there. Head up to that description, check out the links to support the channel. And as always, stay tuned for more great videos coming soon.